So circles, we're going to look at writing equations of circles. So the first thing we need to remember, so when we have our circle, we have our center, and the coordinates are going to be our vertex of h and k. So the radius is from the center to a point on the outside of our circle. And then this point on our circle is going to be our x and our y value. So we're going to use the distance formula. So our distance formula, this is x2 minus x1 squared plus y2 minus y1 squared. Now we're going to use the radius. And because our h and our k values, these are our x1 and our y1. So let's write that as like our x1 and y1. We're going to substitute that in. So we're going to have x minus h squared, and we'll have y minus k squared. So again, we can rewrite this if you want the r squared. So our r squared value, this gets rid of our square root. So we'll have x minus h squared plus y minus k squared. So this is the information we're going to use. So if we sum this up, equations of circles. So when our center, our vertex, so when the vertex, the center is at 0, 0, or when our vertex center has been translated by hk. So this is the equation that we're going to use. So the radius will be the same, but we'll have, this is going to be our x squared plus y squared is r squared. So we'll remember this when our vertex or center is at 0, 0, at the origin. And then if it's been translated, it's translated by h and k, we'll have x minus h squared plus y minus k squared is r squared. So this is what we need to remember. So let's have a look at an example. Okay, so this real world example. <coughs> so the key information that we have. So, the store, Appliance and More, offers free delivery within 35 kilometers of the store. The Abu Dhabi store is located, so this is the Abu Dhabi store, and it's located 100 kilometers north and 45 kilometers east of the corporate office. The corporate office is at the origin. So. If we draw, this is our corporate office at zero, zero. And we know that the Abu Dhabi store is 100 kilometers north. So let's write 100. And it is 45 kilometers east. So 45 kilometers east. So if our store is here, this is the center, so that our vertex is hk, which is going to be at 45, 100. So this is our Abu Dhabi store. So we're going to have a circle with a center and the radius, we're told, is 35 kilometers. So now we need to look at uh, our equation. So the first of all, it's not at the center. So we're going to be using x minus h squared plus y minus k squared is r squared. Now we're going to substitute in the values that we know. So r this is 35, so 35 squared. So x 
our h value. So this is going to be minus 45. And that's squared. And then we have y and our k value is going to be 100. So it's minus 100 squared. So just to work this out, we'll have x minus 45 squared plus y minus 100 squared. And then this is 1,225. So this is our equation of our circle. Okay, guided practice question, Wi-Fi. So there's a question for you to try. So when you're ready for the answer, just press play. Okay, so a certain Wi-Fi phone has a range of 30 kilometers. So this is key information. In any direction, if the phone is four kilometers south, three kilometers west write an equation to represent the area within which the phone can operate via a wi-fi system so the first thing we're going to do is sketch so it says if the phone is 30 kilometers in any direction so this is going to be the radius if the phone is four kilometers south so if this is the original so it's four kilometers south so south is going to be, so one, two, three, so let's say four kilometers, so it's going to be minus four. And then it says, and three kilometers west. So west is going to be this way, so that's minus three kilometers. So it's going to be at this, this point here. So this is going to be our vertex, which is at minus three minus four so this is our h and k our radius so it says 30 kilometers so from here if we were to draw a circle we would have a radius of 30 kilometers this is going to go up so let's label this at let's say this is 26 right here so this radius is going to go all the way up um, to about here. So we'd have a circle which not very good circle but we'd have a circle with a radius of 30. Let's just make that a bit better. So a circle with a radius of 30. So radius is 30 kilometers. So we need to write our equation. So we're going to use x minus h squared plus y minus k squared is r squared and substituting the values. So this time h is minus 3, so it's going to be minus minus 3 squared. And k is minus 4, so that's going to be minus minus 4 squared. And our radius is 30 squared. So x plus 3 squared, y plus 4 squared is 900. And there's our equation.